New at 11, the Big East Conference could be on the move. The new revamped conference, currently based in Providence, has a bunch of new schools and a new TV deal, but could they soon have a new city to call home? Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell went searching for answers and joins us with more on what she's learned from the Providence Mobile Newsroom. We know the new Big East will be headquartered in New York City, but there are still a lot of unanswered questions about what that will mean for the league's employees and its office space in downtown Providence. From downtown Providence to New York City, the Big East is moving. It's a decision league officials made at last week's conference tournament. We all agreed New York is the easiest place for all of us to get in and out of. And that symbolically we needed to represent something new. Uh, I abstain from that vote. Though the conference's main office will be in New York City, we've learned there could be a satellite office to avoid the steep price tag that goes along with rent in Midtown Manhattan. I think some of the back uh, office stuff can stay someplace else. Whether that would be here in Providence, in a suburb of New York, I don't know. Because of that uncertainty, the future of Big East employees is also uncertain. We're close to the point where we can have actual kind of on the record conversations with current Big East employees about possible future employment with us. There's some great people that we definitely are going to want to talk to. And though Big East headquarters are moving, Jim Bennett, Providence's Director of Economic Development, says the league's realignment is actually a good thing for the city. It uh, uh, certainly stabilizes and brings a lot of revenues and focus on Providence. And the new Big East will be made up of 10 teams next season with plans to expand. We've also learned the league reached a broadcast deal with Fox and retained its deal with Madison Square Garden. The new conference hopes to have a commissioner in place by July. We're told at least temporarily the old Big East will remain here in Providence. In Providence with the Mobile Newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.